Welcome to the Woodlawn Word. I'm Marie. And I'm Eliana, and we're here to start with your upcoming events around the school. We currently do not have anything this week, but next Tuesday will be our first club day of 2019. The schedule will have minor changes to fit in the extra 30 minutes of club time. In addition to this, the gifted and great scholar students will be taking a field trip to the Jewish Film Festival. Going into national news, former Uber driver Jason Dalton pleaded guilty on Monday to killing six people during a 2016 shooting spree in Kalamazoo, Michigan. Prosecutors said they would agree to Dalton's plea if he took responsibility for his actions and admitted guilty to all counts against him. Dalton decided to confess to his actions to spare his family and the families of the victims. Ultimately, Dalton professed to six counts of murder, two counts of assault with intent to commit murder, and eight felony firearm charges. I've wanted to do this for a while, Dalton told the court when explaining his guilty confession. Moving into the weather, today is going to be a partly cloudy day with a high of 61 and a low of 36, as well as a 0% chance of precipitation. Going into tomorrow, it will be a bright sunny day with a high of 55 and a low of 37. There will also be a 0% chance of precipitation. Moving into Woolock Sports, the boys and girls basketball teams have a home game today against South Baton Rouge Charter. The cost of the game is $3, so you should go out and support the Panthers. For local sports, on January 1st, the LSU Tigers beat UCF in the Fiesta Bowl with a final score of 40-32. The Saints will be taking on the Philadelphia Eagles in the Superdome on Sunday, January 13th to decide who will be advancing to the NFC Championship. For entertainment today, the comedian named Chris Rock denied any interest in the now-dreaded Oscar hosting gig on Monday night. The incident took place at the New York Film Critics Circle Awards dinner in Manhattan. If it was five years ago, I could say something really offensive and funny right now, but I can't do that anymore, Rock said as he took the podium at the NYFCC Awards. As always, we're going to be ending today's news with a quote of the day. Roy T. Bennett once said, Believe in yourself. You're braver than you think, more talented than you know, and capable of doing more than you imagine. Thanks for watching the Woodlawn Word. Be sure to tune in next time.